Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, we'll give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and the Son, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Rakakwadash, double honor to the apostles, the elders of GMS, and rule well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect. This is GMS Stop and Listen on location with the brother uh, GMS News of Moth, Missouri. Shalom, Allah. Hey, man. Uh, this is a little short, quick lesson, man. Nothing, nothing, you know, extended. I was listening at, uh, on the way up here. Uh, the Zaquan uh, Yashawama had did a class. Uh, it was on a, uh, basically Israel uh, stop basically doing what they were doing. Week. It was a video he just did. It was called, uh, man, I can't even think of it now. Uh, all, all Israel had to do was stop, but that was the name of the video. And um, I heard it this morning because hey, quite a few brothers was up late last night. I was even up late traveling, so uh, I actually saw the video and then, you know, just sitting here and around here thinking, uh, pondering on that video, I was like, uh, you know, reading through scripts and I just want to add something to that video. Just add a few scriptures to it. Oh. Uh, this is uh, Wisdom of Solomon. Get Wisdom of Solomon 5 and uh, if you want to uh 13 we do 13 and 14. Okay. you said wisdom of solomon 5 verse 13 and 14. yeah i just want to you know add a few scriptures man because that was a that was a beautiful lesson that the sakuran did so it's just sometimes you know when you're reading you see other scriptures that go right along with a lesson and uh i would just want to add to it because that was a beautiful lesson you know, the brother going to read. I got it up on the screen. Started 13. Start at 13. Huh. Even so, we, in like manner, mm -hmm. make sure that's KGB, assume as we were born, began to draw to our end. So soon as we've been born, hey, we've been getting to draw to our end, meaning what? The end of life. But that's for you wicked, because the elect are going to basically be saved and they're going to live. Go ahead. And had, it says, and had no sign of virtue to show. No sign of virtue to show. Meaning what? Character, man. Right? And when the brother was going into it, you got Israelites out there right now. They come on the, They come on these uh, different comment boards. They're doing these different videos. And their doctrine, the doctrine that they're preaching is wrong. You got these females out here that are actually uh, saying that they're prophetess and all. Prophetess. Yeah. See that that has no virtue in it. That's showing bad character because you're not you're not basically for that woman. You're not uh, being in a woman place according to the scriptures. And for you other Israelites who are Israelites who know the name who are trying to preach these other doctrines and slip in your little doctrine to the uh, you know and add to it. What are you doing it for? You're doing it for uh, basically like uh, some kind of attention, man. Yeah. And the scriptures gonna talk about that. In it, you know. They want to get shine from it. You know. Say that again. They want to get shine from it. They Come. want to try to uh, attain unto some kind of shine because the truth is getting uh, glorified. See, you want you looking for some kind of honor yeah. in being wrong, man. We're having bad character, yeah. you know. You know. Go ahead. And it says, and had no sign of virtue to mm -hmm. show, but were consumed in our own wickedness. Consumed in the, in your own wickedness, man. So you went too far with it, you know. The Most High turns you over to what being a, having a reprobate mind, man. And you just, you go too far with it, way past wicked, man, to the point you think you're right, man, with all these different doctors, man, different books that you read and you want to incorporate into the truth, you know? That's why it says, hey, when you're born, you're drawing near to the end, man. You you two-thirds, man. All you had to, like the brother said, yeah, all you had to do was just stop. But no, man, that's why the Lord, in Zechariah 13 chapter, he said, what, two-thirds are going to, but they're going to be cut off and die. He turned you over to that reprobate mind state. This has to happen. This is part of prophecy. And this lets you know that the scriptures are true, man. This is part of the prophecy when you see them people going into their own doctrines, mm -hmm. right? And preaching their own own thing. You got the women coming on talking about their prophetess, which the brother beautifully explained. A woman can have a dream. Hey, you have a dream. You just put up the dream and let the man of the Lord interpret it. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. They want, they want to, because that's the woman trying to 
see because this society, if you notice, this society has puffed these women up to where when Jake has some kind of form of authority or some kind of show of uh, power, it, it offends them in a way that they feel because society has put them above us. Mm -hmm. So they don't know how to feel when Jake, because now through this beast, the truth, we're being made to be what? The men of the Lord. It says the pastor of my what is men. Yeah. The pastor That's of my flock, flock is men. So mm -hmm. it's dealing with men. So these women are feeling the type of way. So they say, oh, I got some prophecy too to try to make themselves in the society. Like, like mm -hmm. the apostle said, you've been Americanized. That's nothing yeah. but an Americanized Hebrew woman trying to put her own spin being indoctrinated by Esau, man. Yeah. That's and, it. And they've told you you're equal to a man. Exactly. So therefore you think you could be a, a prophet. No. It tells you in Proverbs 8 and 4. Uh, Proverbs 8 and 4. Uh, let me get that. I got you. You got it? Yeah, I'm a I'll stay right, right here. I'll stay oh, right yeah. here. This, script. this is Proverbs 8 and verse 4. Mm-hmm. And it says, unto you, O man, I call, See? and my voice is unto the sons of men. See, to the men, the voice of the Lord call unto men, man. Your women have your place, man. You know, to guide the house, to teach the other women how to be what? Israelite women. You know, that's that's the place, man. You know? And the word there for sons is bun. Gun. Yeah. You're not, you're not, you're not going to be out there on the streets, man. You know, until you other cats is pushing them away with doctors, man, it's going to be a destructive end for you. You know, a, a destructive end is coming. Uh, let me show you. It's uh, let's get Proverbs. I think it's a proverb. I want to say it's uh, either 10 and 25 or 11, 11 and 7, 11 and 7. Proverb 11 and 7. And it says when a wicked man died. Mm -hmm. His expectation shall perish. See, his expectation shall perish. His hope, right, is going to perish, man. Go ahead. And the hope of an un of unjust men perish. See, their hope is what? Their expectation, their expectation is basically of what? For one, they want riches. When you see them pushing those other doctors, they probably be really be wanting to start them, their own church, yeah. have a following. Right, and then you go into it. It goes into uh, they want to be honored, man, and what they're saying. But like the scriptures say, you you having that uh, no virtue, you, that's bad character for you to be uh, pushing the wrong doctrine and constantly constantly talking uh, talking bad about the the true men of the Lord who are pushing the word and doing as the word is is speaking of, man. You know, y'all 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 constantly uh, 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 basically uh. Try to down down rate us, man, through the spirit, you know, through the wicked spirit that's on you, through the spirit and power, y'all, by Shem Yahweh Shai. We're gonna keep pushing the real truth, man, and that's part of prophecy, man. In the last days, should come scoffers, man. I was just thinking that, <laughs> you know, you, so. yeah, you taking the spirit. <laughs> uh, you want me to keep going? Eight. Hey, there's some more meat. It's some more on it. Yeah, it says the righteous is delivered out of trouble, and the wicked cometh in his stead. So the righteous is going to be delivered out of the trouble that's coming, right? So when that this is going to be a big payback for y'all um, mocking the men of the Lord, preaching these wayward doctrines, trying to get honor where you have no character. At. You, your character is this is bad character and trying to get honor and, and talking shit about the men of the Lord. You know, always on the comment board and you women also. But you're gonna you're gonna be caught up in it, man. Okay, go back to uh, Wisdom of Solomon. Uh -huh. It's going to be a destruct destruction unto you. And it says, for the hope of the ungodly is like the dust of a blown away. It's uh, like the it's start, start that over. I think that's the next verse. Right? Yes, it's 14. Okay. You want me, to, you want me to go back? Just to go back, back yeah, read it. And, then. Okay, kind. and this is uh, Wisdom of Solomon 513. Even so, we in like manner, as soon as we were born, began to draw to our end and mm -hmm. had no sign of virtue to yeah. show. But we're consumed in our own wickedness. Okay, that's bad character. Uh, them acting with reprobate spirits and being those spiritual scoffers. That's bad character. Uh, trying to pr push the truth, being a woman. You know, it's bad character, man. And, and you know, you're consumed in that. That's wicked. Man. Yeah. Go ahead. It says, for the hope of the ungodly is like the dust of that is blown away with the wind. The dust blown away in the wind. 
that so your hope your hope is gone yeah that tiny dust when it blows in the wind it's gone mm -hmm. you might you never see it so your expectation of what you're trying to get in honor is it's over for you you're gonna get destruction man Dispensate. you're gonna receive destruction it for disp it. dispensates uh -huh. clear it says blown away with the wind like a t uh uh like a tin froth that, thin froth yeah mm -hmm. thin thin froth that is driven away with the storm uh -huh. like as the smoke with is which is dispersed here and there with a tempest mm -hmm. and passeth away as the remembrance of an of a guest that tarrieth but a day. God but a day. day. So yeah. let me get that froth because froth is gonna go. It's like the, I think uh, the foam that it's on top yeah, of like you they, know when the they foam got like foams up. you got like one definition. Uh, she just came up and went away, man. These phones, man. Esau is doing taking a bandwidth from these phones. You know, they're pushing um, people to that 5G. They're going to slow up the bands and then force everybody to get that 5G system. Mm -hmm. Just like the place that, you know, every they make the one break down so they can turn around and sell you the new one. God. It says bubbles that form or on yeah. liquid, yeah. something that is appealing, but that has no serious value or interest. Man. So, <laughs> so when y'all doing, when y'all come against and preach these other doctors and, and constantly scoff against the real men of the Lord that seems appealing to who? The other two thirds, man. Mm -hmm. But it has no value in it. It's only going to be death uh, to you for that, man. There's no value in the kingdom for you scoffing, man. The Lord has the Lord has sent you the pastors according to his own heart that they'll feed you understanding, which are the men of great millstone and the elders start with the elders, apostles, man. Right? Yeah. It's nothing to be in. It's nothing to pride. It's just who who is chosen just like with, I would uh, um, even I, you know even with lots you know if you look into the, the, the scriptures a lot lot was played a lot you know when Nate was like oh that's wicked you know when it went to the uh, the time of the goat that would uh, the, it, where you had the goat that was presented to the Lord in the time of the, uh, uh, atonement you'd have the goat that was presented to the Lord and the, the goat the escape goat and how did you determine the escape goat from the goat that was sacrificed you cast a lot so the priest would cast the lot. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So the lot has fell. So then the spirit, the lot has fell upon us being what we are, man. You know, mm -hmm. that's our lot. Then when he say you take your lot, a, a, a prophet is what? Subject unto the prophet. That's your lot. We've been chosen for this, man. You know, it, it, it's a choice. It's a, 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 a divine intervention that's been put upon Jake, man. But they're yeah. fighting against it because they don't understand the choice they, that's why it says his thoughts are not your thoughts man they're kicking against the bricks man that's it hey y'all was shot to a yeah, paul man it. this is uh we get one more okay, this is huh? psalms 2 and 9. Mm -hmm. thou shalt break them with a rod of iron thou shalt dash them into pieces like the potter's vessel now, when you read that, it's, it's talking about your house shy having a heathen. Mm -hmm. But guess what? You people who are preaching these wayward doctrine, you Israelites who call on the Lord, but you're not, but you're not following the SOP, the standard operate procedures of the scriptures, right? Who are scoffing, being reprobates, man, coming against the true men. The Lord is going to soon come. When he come, you're going to be having that confusion of faith, but mm -hmm. you're going to be shamed, bro. Yeah. He's going to break you into pieces like the rod, like with a rod of iron. That rod of iron going to be first. It's going to be those, uh, the nuclear. It's going to be uh, first sedition among men, famine, pestilence, the race riots. The bear, the lion, the snake. Yeah, the bear, the lion, the, the, the dilemmas that you're going to be getting caught up in. Yeah. Then also mean that the chariots and the thermonuclear destruction. This is what's going to break you into pieces. Just like Zechariah 13 and 8, man. Two thirds going to be cut off and die, man. So you got anything else you want to say? Uh -huh. Huh, hey, same. man, with that, just a little short lesson, man. You know, just, uh, uh, hey, bro, just uh, brother did a beautiful video earlier this morning. Shit, it was like time where he, he was supposed should have been asleep, but the spirit had him up, Doing you know, it. and the uh, spirit had a lot of us up because I watched the video. It was beautiful. So I just want to add on to it, man. You know, with that, all praise, honor, and glory be to the Heavenly Father and His Son. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Rekakodash. Double honor to the apostles, the yeah. elders, of GMS who rule well. Peace and bless to the hopeful elect. GMS, stop and listen. Hey, with the brother GMS uh, of Missouri, Mott. Shalom. Shalom. Mm.